Hello everybody. This is the grass in the backyard. And I'm about to show you something that's one of my favorite bikes that Panasonic ever made. And there it is. Yes, that is in fact the 1988 DX5000. And this is the second one that I own. And I use that term loosely because it is actually very quickly going to be shipping to Texas to the next collector owner. Uh, he has recently acquired a 1988 MC7500 mountain bike, which also uses the same paint scheme. Top of the line, that mountain bike has prestige tubing as well, as does this. So if we go in, you can see it's got that very nice, lightweight, springy prestige tubing. The totally, totally, totally tubular <laughs> 80s paint scheme. And I mentioned that prestige tubing, you gotta be very careful when you're shopping for these there's a tiny, tiny little ding here, just a little nick that's very thin tubing, and it's very easy to, to ding. Uh, that one's super faint, but it's still there. You get a teeny, tiny bit of rust that can form on those, but a little bit of touch-up, that'll be fine. This bike is actually in really nice shape overall. In fact, it's very unique in that it has the original vinyl handlebar wrap, kind of as it came out of the box and I haven't seen I see very few of these you know 4,000s and 5,000s with the original vinyl and even the bar ends on this are the correct original bar end if I can get that to focus maybe not <laughs> but the only thing not original obviously this horrible vetted gel saddle which I loathe these things and the continental tires have obviously been changed but aside from that, this one is all original, down to the rims. It has the original, these, uh, these were on the bike originally, super hard anodized. A lot of them were, were uh, replaced under kind of like a silent recall because they would make a clicking noise from the spoke eyelets. In fact, my own set was replaced with some, I believe it's sun wheels that, the, that mine has. But, you know, Shimano 600. Altegra tricolor, really good stuff, really smooth riding. One of my favorite riding bikes. This one's in just very nice original condition. And like I said, it's gonna go to Texas here soon to a collector. It was originally sold at Lakeshore Cyclery in Storm Lake, Iowa. So shout out to you guys if you're out there, drop me a line. Uh, would love to hear from you and maybe if someone there still knows the old Panasonic days <laughs> uh, I'd love to kind of pick your brain on a few things because I actually had bought mine new at Lakeside Cycle Reef in Clear Lake so not too far away so it's pretty interesting to find one I actually found this in St. Cloud Minnesota and uh, ended up passing this on to my friend Nick in Texas so it's headed his way shortly but I will mention this bike I have three more coming, so watch the channel, watch the webpage, watch the Facebook group and page, and I won't tell you what they are right now, but it's three bikes that you've not seen from me yet, so hmm, ponder. <laughs> you can place your, put your guesses in the uh, comments below and let me know what you think might be coming down the tubes here. So hope you're all having a great summer so far. It's a scorching hot one here in Minneapolis, and I will talk to you all soon. Take care.